Welcome back to the Arboretum, everyone. We are here to check on the progress of the flowering cherries, and they are looking pretty spectacular right now. They're buzzing with the energy of pollinators. And we have Alex, our curator of collections, with us to tell us a little bit about this, these magnificent trees. Alex, what's so special about the flowering cherries? So the flowering cherries are really important in Japanese culture and the reason for that is because the flowers don't last a long time on the trees. So when Japanese people look at the flowers, they kind of equate to the ephemerality of life and just how short life is, but just how beautiful it can be as well. So. And that kind of permeates through the rest of their culture as well. Yeah, so like at flowering cherry time, you know, Japanese people typically come and celebrate the cherry trees. Uh, so the blossoms are called sakura. The viewing of the blossoms is called hanami and typically people come down and they'll have a picnic under the trees, they'll relax under the trees. If you're really lucky you can lie back and look at the flowers against the blue sky. So it's a really spectacular way to experience the cherry collection. Yeah, now mentioning food, our cafe does have some wonderful specials at the rock garden in order to help celebrate the flowering cherries. They've got a nice matcha semi fredo that sounds pretty good. I know, that's where I'm going to be this week. So. <laughs> now, uh, we do have some cherries at the rock garden as well, right? We do, yeah. So the cherries at the rock garden, are, they're a little younger than the cherry trees in the Arboretum. And they were part of a project that was launched by the Japanese consulate of Japan in Toronto uh, in 2011. We received some trees from them as part of a project to send cherry trees all the way across Ontario. So it's a really cool project to work on. And there's a really neat one with green flowers there. There is. There's a, there's a cherry with green flowers. It's super rare, but it's also super old. So it's kind of like on its last leg. So we'll see what kind of flowers it produces this year. But if you're lucky enough to see it, the flowers are spectacular. Nice. Now, how about the ones here in the Arboretum? We have uh, quite a number of older trees here. We do. So the, che the cherry circle that we're standing in right now, this particular variety is called um, Accolade and it was introduced in the UK around about the 1930s. And the trees that you're looking at here today were planted around about 1967. Uh, Japanese cherry trees don't live to be a very old age, so these are the equivalent of seniors. So another great reason to come and see them you know, before they, they finish blooming. Yeah, so there's a number of different places uh, in Ontario that you can go and view cherries. So what's special about ours? Uh, well, when you go to the other sites uh, across Ontario, they tend to have planted a lot of trees en masse, but it's one single cultivar. Whereas our collection is a trifle smaller, but we have much greater diversity. So you can see a lot of different flowers, a lot of different colours, and also the way that people interact with the trees. Mm. Now, you mentioned at the beginning that the blossoms are very ephemeral. So that, how does the weather impact that? Well, that's a great question, Jen, because we're not meant to have very good weather this week. So typically, if you get rain, the flowers can be knocked off the trees, or if the weather gets really cool, that can actually prolong the flowering. But we're kind of thinking peak bloom might be around about Wednesday this week. So the weather's great today. So today would be a great day to come and see the cherries, or tomorrow, uh, because if we get that bad weather later in the week, it might just send them over. Yeah. Okay, well, thank you very much, Alex. We hope that you can all join us to visit the cherries and uh, hopefully they last well into the week but the next couple days are probably your best bet to see peak cherries yeah happy hanami